everyone. I hope that you're all okay today. And if you're not feeling well, I hope you will feel well very soon. I wanted to, at the start of my video today, I wanted us all to just have a little prayer, send out positive vibes. To all our dear friends out in Australia, I can't believe the situation out there, the horrendous fires and the loss of wildlife and domestic animals and people and pets and our property. It's just, I mean, I must admit that I try not to take any notice of the news. I find it all very depressing out there. But, you know, it's everywhere now. I can't not see it. It's on Facebook and Instagram and everywhere, which is, oh, it's just horrific and devastating. And I just want us all, if you would, just to take a minute to think about them, send them positive vibes and prayers to all our friends in Australia. Thank you all so much for doing that with me and I send all my love and prayers to you all out there and anywhere else that there's natural disasters going on. I wanted to show you my beautiful Leslie Carroll today. She's wearing this lovely outfit that her auntie Lucy sent. And it's this beautiful two-piece pink outfit with beautiful lace on it. It's really lovely. It's um, got leggings with feet and it, oh, it's just adorable. And I think she looks so pretty in it. She really does. I hope the picture's okay today. It's a really dark old day again today. So I wanted to show you Leslie Carroll. I think she looks totally amazing in that. And I'm going to change Emma Esther today because you haven't seen her for a while. There's Ginny. She's sitting in the corner. She's got some books there and she's having a little read. Bless her. And she's in a pair of pink dungarees today. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you over to my beautiful Emma Esther. There she is. Hello sweetheart, <laughs> there she is. She is of course the Maisie Sculpt by Andrea Arcella and what I'm going to do today is I'm going to change her. So what I'll do, because she's a bigger baby, I'll just pause you and I'll lay her down. There she is, I hope you're seeing her okay. I changed her into this little Bowden dress that's cream and it's got little geese on it. Um out when I changed her out of her Christmas things but I'm going to change her and put her into another Bowden outfit and it's this two piece that I bought a couple of years ago and it's a green and white striped top and it's got a goose on it with a golden crown and golden legs and a patterned wing that's floral and it's got a floral the same floral pattern in the Peter Pan collar and it's got lots of little embroidered flowers at the bottom. It's got a pair of leggings that are the same material as the collar and the wing. I think that's really nice. And I'm going to put a little pair of pink and white socks on her. And these little bobbly pink shoes. I really like those. They're very casual. And find a little uh, clip to go in her hair. I've got my box out. 
and have a little chat to you all. There we go, darling. Let's just undo your little dress. There she is. Let's pop this off her. Thought you might like to see Emma Esther today, my little smiler. Cheer you up a bit if you're feeling down. I must admit, I've got a bit of the January blues today, and I don't know why. Because I had a great time yesterday. I went out to see Star Wars. Here you go, darling. There she is. Um, with Conrad. And I thoroughly enjoyed it. I absolutely loved it. And I thought it had such a wonderful, positive message at the end of it. And I thought it was really good. And it brought back memories, actually, that I wanted to share with you. There's this girl. There's his legs. There's his legs. There she is. Little cheeky face. She's got such chunky little legs. Look at her legs. Look at the size of these thighs. Very chunky girl, isn't she? She's laughing. She's laughing. Yes, she are. Yeah, um, the very first Star Wars film came out in 77 I think correct me if I'm wrong but I think it was 77 and we were living down in Dorset then Conrad was just a little baby um, and so we obviously didn't take him to see it but um, my eldest boy really wanted to go and see it and so we had to go to the, about an hour away was the nearest cinema. Just get her little leggings on. They're always hard with these little chunky legs. Um, we had to go an hour to the nearest cinema then. There we go, darling. See if I can get them off your fat bottom. She's got a chunky bottom too, haven't you? There she is. She's just laughing. She doesn't care, do you? No. Yeah, we had to go. Let's just pick you up, sweetheart. Come on, Smiler. Come on, darling. Let's just pull these up. There we go. Here she is. Here she is. Here she is, cheeky girl. Here she is. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> She says, I'm having a good laugh, Mum, at your expense. Um, yeah, it was about an hour away. So we left um, Conrad with my sister and went off to go and watch the new Star Wars film. We get there and there is a queue a mile long to get into the cinema. And I really am not exaggerating so my husband went that's very nice i like that on you darling let's turn you over then so i can pop him up um we got into the queue and we queued for hours we queued for two screenings to actually get in to see it so my husband of course there was no mobile phone sense so my husband had to go and find a phone box and phone my sister to say you know what the situation was and she said oh don't worry about it just I'm looking after the baby he's fine that looks really cute on you sweetheart um you know uh, Conrad was fine and you know she just fed him and everything was good and everything so um that looks very cute on her doesn't it fits her nicely with these bent chubby legs she really takes up a lot of room in this but that's okay she's looking okay aren't you patty cake patty cake baker's man bake me a cake as fast as you can prick it and pat it and mark it with e put it in the oven for little emma and me cheeky girl <laughs> you're a cheeky girl Mwah. Love this little girl. She's so cute, aren't you? So cute. Where's your bunny? Do you want your bunny? There he is. Um, 
So anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, she said, don't worry about it, you know, just queue. Anyway, we were in this queue, and as I say, we queued for two screenings of, of it, and then we eventually did get in to see it. But I always remember that there was this little boy in the queue in front of us with his parents, probably the same age as my eldest boy, and he was getting fed up, you know, as children do. And uh, he was jumping about on and off this low wall. And he actually fell and broke his leg. Would you believe it? Poor little lad. So his parents had to go and take him to hospital. So I hope he did get to see it in the finish. But he definitely didn't see it that day. And of course when the queue moved forward... Um, we managed to get in right at the end, whereas if he hadn't have hurt himself, we would still have been waiting for yet another screening. But anyway, we got in there and saw it. I thought it was absolutely fantastic. And I shall never remember that. And every time... Never remember, never forget it. Um, and... Every time I go and see Star Wars movies, I mean, I've seen two on the big... Well, I went to see Return of the Jedi on the big screen as well. But yesterday when I went, as soon as the Star Wars sign comes up and the music, I get such a warmth. And it's just full of memories for me from when my children were small and they used to... Um, they used to keep their pocket money and buy Star Wars figures and everything, you know. I just, oh, I just love Star Wars. The last um, film they made wasn't quite as good. But this one was great. I really enjoyed it. So, yeah. If you haven't seen it, go and see it if you're a Star Wars fan. Let's just get a brush and I'll brush her hair. I thought I'd put a brush on the bed, but... I've probably put something on top of it now, me. But yeah, I enjoyed seeing it. And we just had a very small ice cream to yesterday. We had... Um, I had American birthday cake. Let's sit you up, darling. Come on in. Can I sit you up? There we go. Let's sit her up. And I'll just move you so you can see her while I'm doing my doing her hair. There she is. <laughs> there she is, Cheeky. Just lighten you up a little bit. I think you should be able to see her hair and everything then. Yeah, that looks okay. Um, yeah, we just had a small ice cream because I'm trying to lose weight. And the reason I'm telling you that I had American birthday cake um, and Conrad had like cookies and cream is because we've decided to stop doing movies with mum. Um, we thought it was a good idea. We've done it for a year. But the, we just haven't got the people following or listening to us. So sadly, we're going to give up doing it such a shame but never mind I can tell you on here what I see and you can um, tell me if you've seen it right what are we going to put on with this should we pick a colour out of yeah that's quite cute little dots or a little plain pink oh that's quite nice actually I'll just put this little plain pink one it goes with the pink in the top there we go got lots of these little bows so they've come in for this one because she's got this little tuft of hair at the top here which i adore so there that's very cute isn't it can you see that let's just bring you in a little bit so you can see hopefully you're seeing that okay let me just there we go darken you up a bit She's got very, very fine hair. It looks like she's bald there, doesn't it? But she's actually got blonde hair there. <laughs> but yeah, she's got beautiful hair. So there she is in her outfit. 
and I hope you enjoyed seeing me change her and chatting about Star Wars. Let's back up a little bit so you can see her in her outfit. There she is. I don't want to show me, just my babies. <laughs> there she is. She's gorgeous, isn't she? What I'll do is I'll sit her up against the bed. There we go, darling. You go sit there. And then I can show you what she looks like properly. Let me sit her up. There you go, baby. There she is. That's a really cute outfit by Bowden. Have your rabbit in your other hand and then they can see the little goose there. Yeah, nice little outfit by Bowden. There it is. Trying to get the picture right, it's not very good today. The little leggings, I think she looks adorable in that. Mummy Teddy looks a bit worried. What's wrong, Mummy Teddy? Oh, you're wondering where your little one is. Here he is, look. <laughs> she worries where her baby is. There's her baby. He was with his dad, I think. So there she is, and my beautiful Emma Esther. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing her and the pitch wasn't too bad. And listening to my memories of going to see Star Wars for the first time with my little boy. It was such a shame that other little boy broke his leg. These things happen, don't they? So yeah, you all have a good rest of your Sunday and we will see you during the week. Mwah. Love you ladies and gentlemen.